Hey everyone! So today's video is just going to be a little short vlog, hopefully short. We'll see how my timing goes. So if you may have noticed, I've actually been posting a lot more videos than I normally do. I've only really posted maybe like two videos, but they've all been within like the past week or like at least like seven days. And that may not seem like such a big deal. I know that a lot of beauty gurus are able to post videos like every day. But if you guys really follow me and you know a lot about my personal life, then you know that my work schedule just would not put up with that at all. Two videos a week is like amazing for me, like groundbreaking. Now in my last video I mentioned a little bit that I think that my schedule is about to change really soon and it is. The end of next week is my last week being full time at work and then after that I'm just going to be working like part of the time, which is nothing but positive. This means that I'm going to have a lot more time to make videos and upload. One thing that I miss the most about having a lot more time on my hands is just being able to sit down and in front of my computer, maybe have a cup of coffee on the side, maybe not, but I'd prefer a cup of coffee on the side, um, and just read comments and talk with you guys. Um, I don't know if I ever told you guys what my schedule was like, but imagine this, eight and a half hour shifts every single day, with the exception of every Tuesday, because Tuesdays were my off days, and then every other weekend. So one week I would be working like four days, have a break, but then I would go right back and just work six days straight. Can you imagine that? Six days straight with no break. And then I would have two days off, which was my weekend, and if I was lucky enough to film, you know, you know a, lot of, a lot goes into factor, you know, like depending on the weather, depending on if I have more errands to just run during that weekend. So that's been my schedule since like February, you guys. So that's why I've been so MIA. Um, it, it really takes a toll on your body as well. Like those two days, like the, my every other weekend that I have off, that was not even enough to just recuperate from the previous weeks that I've had. I'm also starting school, I think not next week, but the next week. And this past semester I took off. I haven't set foot into a classroom for about eight months now. So I hope that I'm going to be able to get back into the routine of studying, you know, turning assignments in on time and doing my homework and, you know, planning things like that accordingly because I am the world's worst procrastinator. I'm the type of person that would start an assignment the night before it's due. And that assignment is usually something that I've known about for like, three months. Also I told you in my last video that this is my new background. Um, I'm right in front of my window which is where I should have been from the start but hey I'm dumb and can't figure that hey there's a window which means good lighting. Work with it. So yeah I'm finally making that adjustment. So this is my bed. That's my nightstand and I really want to do something else like if I turn the camera up like maybe a little bit I can put some wall art right there or something but for now this is good. Maybe one day I'll do like a room tour, but honestly I have nothing special to show you guys. My room is literally like a box. This is probably like the coolest angle that you'll get. When do you guys go back to school? Because I know that a lot of you have already started school, which is like crazy to me. I feel so bad for you guys. I'm so sorry. But um, I, I'm sure a lot of you guys start way later than I do, maybe even like um, September or something like that. But either way, didn't the summer just like fly by? I seriously cannot believe that it's already over. I mean, I really felt like I did not do anything. So if you guys had a great summer, that's awesome. I'm kind of jealous. I've also been contemplating lately on whether or not I should get my hair cut before school starts because my hair's gotten pretty long. It's, um, yeah, it's like that long. So yeah, it's like down to here. And that's with my hair like naturally wavy. I'm sure if I straightened it or like blow dried it out, it would be even longer than that. Truth be told, I really don't want to cut my hair, but it's just, it's been getting really dry lately and it's about time. It's been about like five months since I got my hair cut. So the ends have gotten really dry and, um, they are breaking if I want to be honest. I have a lot of split ends, but I really just don't want to cut my hair. I never want to cut my hair because I'm always afraid that they're going to cut, like, they're just going to, like, chop it off. You just got to do it. You got to face reality and get your hair cut every once in a while. I think that this month, um, at the end of August, I'm definitely going to make a favorites video. I haven't made one since I want to say, like, March. It's been a long time. And I really don't do favorite videos too often because I really don't try out new products all the time. So it's not like I would have, like, new things to show you every single month to keep it really interesting. But I want to show you guys one of my favorites that I've been loving, and I'm definitely going to show this in my August favorites video, but if you guys have um, Haagen-Dazs in your grocery stores, you should definitely check out this flavor. It's chocolate peanut butter. Okay, the story behind this is that I have a friend who is from Spain. Hi, Alma. I love you. Te quiero mucho. And when she came to the United States, she found out about peanut butter for the first time. Like, they don't have peanut butter in Spain. Like, she did not know what it was. And then she tried it, and she just hated it. She's like, this is so weird. 
and I was like, are you kidding me? And she's like, if you ever go to Spain, you will never find peanut butter, like, in the grocery stores. I was like, what? Like, peanut butter is, like, a staple. It's like bread. Like, how could you not have peanut butter? You know, she wasn't accustomed to it like we Americans are. Peanut butter is, like, totally an American thing. Then later on, she was only here for, like, six months, but later on, she tried Reese's, the chocolate peanut butter cups, and she loved it. She just absolutely loved that candy. Then she came to the conclusion that I don't like peanut butter, but I like peanut butter when it's mixed with chocolate. Later on down the road, we were basically getting ice cream somewhere and she found that they were serving chocolate peanut butter ice cream and she tried it and loved it and I got to taste a little bit of it and I loved it as well. So then ever since then I've been craving that ice cream flavor and I love haagen -Dazs. I think that haagen actually makes like the best ice cream hands down. You cannot beat haagen -Dazs. And so I went on their website and lo and behold they had a chocolate peanut butter flavor and saw that my nearest grocery store had just gotten a shipment and they had it and then I ate the entire thing. It's empty. <laughs> I love, 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 love this ice cream. Um, it's just so good and rich and creamy. It's like sweet because of the chocolate but then it's like salty because of the peanut butter. Ugh, it's just so good. It's one of those weird combinations like kettle corn. Another thing that I cannot wait for after next week once I have more free time is that I'm going to be able to wear nail polish and I'm not wearing any nail polish now. I have not really been able to wear nail polish because I work in a hospital and I'm not really supposed to be wearing nail polish. Sometimes I cheat and I kind of do anyway. But since I'm not going to be working as often, I'm definitely, definitely going back to my obsession with nail polish. Also, another question for you guys. Let me know if you mind vlogging on my channel because these are the most easiest videos for me to do and they're quick to do. They can be as short as I want or as long as I want. I can edit them very quickly and then just like upload them in the same day. So if you guys wouldn't mind seeing more vlogs like this, like just let me know because I would totally do them more often. So um, I think that that's all that I really have to say for now. Um, I'm glad that I was able to do this. And j So just leave me all of your comments and all of your suggestions down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are the best. I adore all of you so much. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.